Hello YouTube, Sidekick here with another Community A4E Skyhawk tutorial. This time we're doing the much anticipated Case 1 recovery. Uh, but we have a guest pilot today. I'm not going to be flying it because, frankly, I'm not that good at it. So Rob, aka Hotbox, is going to fly the mission and he'll take over the narration here in a minute. Um, just one note, you will find that the video quality changes back and forth a little bit during this video because Rob and I had to combine uh, our videos because unfortunately his track file would not run on my machine, so my apologies for that. Uh, but that shouldn't stop you from being able to pick up the techniques you need to fly a Case 1 recovery. So, over to you, Rob. Okay, get the aircraft set up. I don't have it set to active pause the way I probably should. First thing we're going to call into the carrier. Inbound. Marshall, zero, one, zero. Add some back trim. One, two, nine, four, Read one, the gun sight. Angels, two point five. Stack one point four. Fifty nine. And listen to it. Do a scan. Altimeter is 2993. Case 1 recovery expected DRC 305. Report CU at 10. Okay, report CU at 10. And uh, 2993. Here we go, 2993. Let's get rid of that volume. And now do another scan. Now let's go do the. LS nine. I just saw the needles flip, so it looks good. We're going to descend a bit. Uh, there, we're just passing through ten miles. So let's zero see. One zero. Oh, Abort inbound. Abort, mission. Abort inbound. Oh, what a mistake. Oh well, uh, let's call inbound again. Zero one zero. Marking mobs one three zero four nine. Same Angels down. two. State one point three. Do the hook down. Zero one zero. Mother's weather is visibility ten plus mile. Scattered clouds at eight thousand. Altimeter is two nine oh nine oh three. Case one recovery expected DRC three zero five. Report see me at ten. Warm up the APC. Zero one zero. Zero one zero. See you at ten. State switch tower. Zero one zero. State one point three. Tower zero one zero. Overhead angels one point five. State one point three. Okay, sidekick here. Looks like Rob is pretty well set up for this approach. Uh, case 1 recovery. He's approaching the boat from astern, and he's at around 1,000 feet as he is preparing to fly past and start his brake turn. All right, getting lined up. Uh, hey, in the brake. Speed brake on. That's a back trim. Throttle up, APC on, gear down, flaps down. Ah, that was a mistake. I, I usually like to go gear down, flaps down, get settled, then throw the APC on, but. Sidekick here again. At this point, Rob is looking to be about a mile and a quarter of beam of the boat and coming down to 600 feet when he starts his turn. A bit too low. 
not doing a good scan here. Okay, there's the back of the carrier. Start a nice, easy, level turn onto the BRC. That's all you got to do. Just nice and easy level turn. Mainly scanning the vertical velocity indicator at the bottom there, the climb rate, and the altitude, and then the bank angle. That's in the scan too, the bank angle. Then you can, you know, glance at the boat for a also looking out uh, using the horizon against the canopy brace as a visual reference here for kind of VFR flying. Okay, really watching that descent rate. Okay, I don't like when you roll out and you don't have a ball. So I'm low. Not trying to overcorrect, just trying to get onto that glide slope now. Okay, roll on to final. Zero one zero scooter ball one point two. Follow the ball all the way in. Full throttle, speed brake, throttle back, speed brake off, brakes on. Three wire. Hook up, flaps up, start to taxi. And there you go, folks, a successful case one recovery. Not perfect by any means, but they don't have to be. And I think that's the point that uh, we wanted to make with this video is that you should get out there, give it a try getting on and off the boat. You don't have to be perfect to make it work. But it is one of the joys of flying the Skyhawk. So for now, this is going to be Sidekick and Hotbox signing off.